Good evening from Jim AG 6IF. I'm playing around the Zone Minder here. Uh, if you ever wondered how to make a video from your Zone Minder history, here's how you do it. I've got a few cameras here. Make a selection of uh, your historical video in Zone Minder. I'll just pick my backyard camera here. The last day. And you select one of these segments. And I'll just grab, uh, I'll just grab the first one here, and that's going to bring up. Let me do this. Select it over on the instead of on the thumbnail. Select it over on the event name. It's going to bring up the video. It'll start playing. Uh, at this point, it says video. Click on that. It's going to bring up an export screen. Select your video format. AVI is the standard, and it's pretty fast. You can check the frame rate quite a bit uh, selection in there from 100x down to quarter x. That's a frame rate. If you want to do a quick, like I did a uh, drive, an hour and a half drive home in eight or nine minutes, I selected 10x. But it uh, depends on what you want. If we do a 10x here just for fun. And then the video size, uh, obviously smaller is smaller. If you go half, uh, pretty quick. And uh, generate video. Doesn't take too long on a very fast processor. Raspberry Pi takes a little bit longer. And when it, when it finishes it, it's gonna come up with a box where you can choose to download it or you can play it. Oh, here you go. So you got view, download, and delete. So if you wanted to create a compilation, you can do the download into your video editing software of your choice and um, manipulate it from there. Um, select on view, it's going to bring up a video player screen. Depending on your, I'm running this on Linux, so here in the Ham Shack this afternoon on this Labor Day. Okay, and there's not a whole lot going on there. It's just out the front of my, uh, aimed at my front door. Um, but you could, uh, like I said, you could download this. There's many different formats. The AVI is pretty fast. And delete. I'm going to delete that when I'm done. Close. And uh, so I'm using uh, ZoneMinder. I actually have a ZoneMinder system here in my in my home. Quite a few cameras. I've got a system in my car as well. Dash cams, front and back, and you can do side to side or whatever. Uh, it's a neat little tool. Uh, this is running on a dual core desktop style machine but my car is running on Raspberry Pi too so it works pretty good so uh, thanks for watching this is Jim AG6IF have a nice day 73